Hello, what's up? Today, we are going to discuss the menu bar in Autodesk Sketchbook. We can find the file, edit, image, window and help in the menu bar. Let's start with the file option. Under the file option, you can find the new option. This option will create new working area or canvas for your next project. Next is the new flipbook. This allows you to create simple animation using the Autodesk Sketchbook. Click open to open an existing project or image, and with the use of open recent option, you will able to see your previous projects. Under the file menu, you can also find the save, save as option and you can save your work. You can also add an existing image in your file with the add image option. You can set up your page with the page setup option. And lastly you can print your project and you can also send it using email. These are the options under the file menu. Next is the edit menu. As you can see you can find some shortcuts and editing options under this menu. Aside from this shortcuts, you can also find the preferences option under the edit menu. After clicking this option, a pop-up box will appear, and in here you can now edit your preferred settings. You can edit your general settings, your preferred canvas size and the other, just explore and discover different stuff under the preferences option. Third, is the image menu. You can edit the image and canvas size under the image menu. After clicking the image size, a pop-up box will appear, and in here you can now edit the document size. Just and click the key proportions in order to edit the width and the height of the document. Under the image menu, you can also rotate the image, counterclockwise, clockwise, you can also flip vertically your image, mirror layer and you can use the symmetry option. After some drawing, you can now adjust the color of your drawing. Under the image menu, just click the adjust option. With the use of this option you can adjust the brightness, contrast, hue, saturation, color balance, you can also convert the color to grayscale and invert the image. Next is the window menu. Under this menu you can find the toolbar, lagoon, color pack, brush pack, brush palette, brush library, layer editor, color editor, copic library, sketchbook extras and the default layout. This menu allows you to control the components or shortcut bars that may appear on your screen or working area. You can hide this shortcut bars by clicking your desired option. Now in order to show again your desired shortcut bars, just click again the option. Just click the default layout in order to show the original layout of the Autodesk Sketchbook window. Last, is the help menu. You can find the sketchbook help, quick tour, sketchbook blog, check for updates and about sketchbook options under thus menu. This menu gives you an answer and help for some of your questions about Autodesk Sketchbook. You can find also some tutorials and inspirations for your next project under this menu. That's all for the menu bar of the Autodesk Sketchbook. If you have any questions about this topic, just comment down below and let's talk more about your questions. You can also give some suggestions about some topics and I will make another video about this. I hope you learned something. Stay safe always and more power.